coming up. The timekeeper jerks his bell cord. Somehow it jams, and Willard doesn't hear the faint sound over the excited yelling. He pauses, looks around, puzzled, doubtful. Say, what's going on around her anyhow? Where's the bell? There it is. So the big fight begins, and Big Jess moves easily into action. The mahogany hued Dempsey circles, moving in and out with cat footed quickness. The champion wants to keep Jack at long range with his poking left jab, but Dempsey won't let him do it. He's never still for an instant, bobbing and weaving around. It looks like a test of speed against power, and Willard has no chance to get set against Dempsey's speed. At such a pace, there's a lot of missing and a lot of pinching. It's bound to be that way, but it's only a warm up so far. Each is trying to figure out the other's defense, to open him up, nail him with a punch. The challenger crowds, keeps on crowding. The instant he's in the open, he moves back again. His left whips in tirelessly and often. The blows miss or graze Willard. Dempsey hasn't the range yet. Jess holds whenever he can, but that Jack's meat. Nobody's strong enough to tie him up for long, and trying to hit him is like trying to hit a sunbeam that moves away. Dempsey's hands are in motion all the time. Willard tries to block with gloves and forearms and elbows, but he's compelled constantly to...